Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and that's a 69 Chevelle. This baby's been on the rotisserie, that's right, the bottom side of it's just as nice as the top side. As you can see, the chrome on the front bumper's looking sweet, that grill's looking sweet. I mean, everything about the car just off the hook. You're gonna need to buy some mirrors to check out the bottom side of this when it's a car show. It's got a 454 under the hood. She is beautiful, man. That paint is just as slick as can be. It's got a light metallic in it. The hood's fitting good. I mean, everything about the car just sweet as can be. The stance is looking sweet. It's got some good looking American Racing 17 inch wheels on there, wrapped in some Nitto rubber. The white stripe going down the side, all the stainless looks like it's new, all the chrome, the door handles look new. And check out the interior, man. My favorite color interior in a muscle car, it's black. We got great looking uh, upholstery on the seats. We got seat belts in the front and in the rear. We got brand new carpeting in there. Headrest is looking good. The uh, package tray, the headliner, the dash itself is in beautiful shape. She is bright and shiny, inside, outside, bottom side, the whole nine yards. Grab the keys here so we can take a look in the trunk. I really like the stance on it. All the chrome around the uh, taillight bezels all looking sweet. The chrome on the back bumper looking sweet. Inside the trunk, look at that. Looks like brand new metal in there. All blue painted, looking good. We got a great looking wheel well in there. Backsides of the quarters are all nice and clean. Bottom side of the deck lids all nicely painted. As you look down the passenger side, everything looking sweet over here. Again, the stance looking sweet. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do any consignment whatsoever. That means we own this car. So you know we spent our time checking it out before we bought it. Then the first thing that happens to every car here is they go up on the lift so we can inspect them, take pictures, and finish up this video. You're going to see the bottom side also. Chevelle time, baby. Big block under the hood. Looking beautiful. Let's head out to Cars and Coffee right now and show off this beautiful machine right here. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we can ship this Chevelle anywhere in the world. You just give Tom a call anytime. That man answers his phone just about seven days a week and almost 24 hours a day. So you can give him a call. He'll tell you all about this machine and how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. Now the power steering's feeling good, the power brakes are feeling good, we're looking good, we're on a good stance. Like I said, this baby's been on the rotisserie, so the bottom side of it's just as clean as the top side. It's sounding good too, it's got a little bit of a rumble to it, but it's got some fairly quiet mufflers on it, so you have to worry about waking up the neighbors. You guys all know me, I don't care about waking up the neighbors. I just assume the neighbors know when I'm leaving. <laughs> Get up early. Now we're outside the Motor City here, so if you'd like to come visit us, we'd love to have you. We can take you over to Junction, show you all the cars over there. If you're coming in to look at this car in particular, if you could please give us a call, let us know you're coming. That way we can make sure we got your favorite car right up front where you can see it. We'll even get it up on the hoist and take a look at the bottom side. You can see down here on the dash, looks like all the gauges are working, our speedo's working, looks like the tack's working there. 
we do have aftermarket air conditioning, but it's all um, mounted right here in the stock location. It does have an aftermarket radio in it also. There's a voltage gauge uh, mounted underneath the dash so you can tell what the alternator's charging at. Now we're going to head back to the shop where we're going to put this baby up on the lift like we do every car at Vanguard. A lot of places just put the fancy ones up on the lift. At Vanguard we put every car on the lift so you can check out the bottom side. And make sure you share this video with your buddies and subscri subscribe, I can't say that word, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We're always posting new, exciting inventory. You never know from one day to the next what kind of car we'll be getting in. So you got to keep a close eye on us, guys. We're pulling up on our shop right now here at 15100 Keel Street, Plymouth, Michigan. So stick with us. We're going to put this baby up in the air right now. All right, we're underneath this Chevelle now, and man, is it pretty under here. Look at that. Brand new tank beautiful blue paint on the bottom side of the uh, trunk floor there beautiful paint on the frame brand new exhaust new body bushings we got a 10 volt rear end here with aftermarket hardware here holding it in um, up lowers and uppers um, we got brand new shocks we got disc brakes we got brand new brake lines you can see the drilled and slotted rotors we got right around a 3.0 gear and the uh, rear end and it is limited slip Brand new, uh, what looks like an aluminum drive shaft here. We got some uh, fairly quiet mufflers. Uh, they're kind of middle of the road. Um, you can see the blue paint on the floorboards here, just looking slick as can be. We got a brand new brake line going front to back. We have a brand new uh, fuel line over here on the other side going front to back. Again, you can see the frames all painted up nice here. I see new body bushings here. We got a Turbo 350 Trans. It's a three-speed automatic. Uh, it's got a nice aluminum pan on it. We got jet coated headers. We got a chrome cover on the torque converter here. Cross members in beautiful shape. A lot of times these things are all beat to hell. Uh, we got tubular upper and lower control arms. Uh, so all that's all brand new. We got disc brakes up front also. We got a big uh, red sway bar on there looking sweet. Now I always check out the front frame horns, make sure they're in nice straight shape. You can tell car's never been in a, a major accident at least you, you know you don't see any twisting or anything front bumper looks like it's a re-chromed unit uh, always take a look at the core support too you can see that's been all painted up it's looking good um, and then the tires these things look like they're fairly new these are uh, triple triple nickels these are the uh, nittos uh, these are i believe they were 225 there it is 225 50 17s on some good looking American racing wheels. And as you look down the side of the car, that blue paint is looking sweet. I always look at the bottom side of the rocker. You can tell that this painter wasn't afraid to bend over because the bottom side of the rocker is painted. Always feel the back side too, that'll tell you the story. Back side feels like smooth paint looking good now out back here again we got triple nickels back here too and these are 255 50 17s and they even took the time to uh, paint the wheel well look at that and you can still see the spot welds see those spot welds right there i tell you this thing is beautiful let's lower it down and take a look under the hood so check this baby out under the hood man you are going to be proud to pop the hood of this thing when you pull into a car show you can see everything that can be chromed is chromed. Anything that can be polished is polished. Anything that needs a beautiful paint job has got a beautiful paint job on it. Uh, we got new brake lines up here. We've got a fairly new master cylinder here. It looks like a brand new power booster, so it is power brakes. You can see those tubular upper control arms. I see brand new shims in the uh, upper control arm crossbars there. Um, those uh, valve covers are all polished up looking good. That's polished aluminum. It looks like the intake has been um, sent over. It looks like, can't tell, well, it may be polished. It looks like it's polished aluminum or it's got a really good looking powder coat on it. Uh, underneath there is a Holley four barrel. That's a 750. It is a dual uh, feed carburetor. You can see that the uh, alternator looks like it's a rebuilt unit. They did a real nice job on the firewall also. See how they shaved that all down? Nice, smooth metal, beautiful paint. Then it's got the block off plate. 
Normally you'd have a great big box in there for the evaporator for the AC, but it's got an aftermarket setup on the AC, so all that's underneath the dash now. I mean, everything under here is nicely painted, looking sweet, so give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Show spark this little dream in your driveway.